Hi, this is Andrew from Regency Lighting, and today we're going to take a look at a new ultraviolet, germicidal ultraviolet fixture. Uh, this is a tabletop or desktop unit that can be used to disinfect surfaces with UVC light. Now, this unit includes a motion sensor to auto cut off if someone is sensed in the room because ultraviolet light is harmful for our skin and eyes. Uh, and then this unit also has a couple of different run cycles. As we test this unit, we're going to use something called a dosimeter card. The center of this card is yellow, which means it has not reacted to or been exposed to any UVC light in the 254 nanometer range. On the upper side, it's orange. On the lower side, it's pink. And these colors correspond to different dosages or levels of exposure to UVC light in that 254 nanometer range. What we'll watch for is for this center yellow circle to change color over time as it's exposed to light produced by this fixture. Okay, I've placed a few of these dosimeter cards around the fixture and I'll explain where I've placed these. One is in front of the unit on the conference table. Another of these is in the shadow of this support on the fixture. So what we really wanna see here is does the shadow affect the ability for this to disinfect surfaces around it? Or are we gonna to have to place this in a few different positions to be able to disinfect the whole area? I've also placed one, these are, have a self-adhesive strip on the back, so I've placed one on our whiteboard and another one a little bit further away on the floor uh, so that we can get a sense for the range and if there's any difference between the color change on the dosimeters that are close to the, to the unit versus those that are a little bit further away. We'll go ahead and get this unit started and then we'll come back in a few minutes after the cycle has finished to check the dosimeter cards and see what we found. We finished the run cycle on this ultraviolet fixture and now we'll take a look at the dosimeter cards. You can see that this first card turned pink in the center, indicating that it had the highest level of UVC exposure. And this card that was on the side to the unit and in the shadow of the support structure for this fixture was not exposed to enough ultraviolet to turn the center from yellow even to orange, the lower dosage level. If we look on the whiteboard in the back, we can see that this card was also exposed to enough uh, to reach somewhere between the orange and the pink. And finally, we have a dosimeter card on the floor and this one remained yellow in the center, similar to the one that was in the shadow on the surface of the conference table. And this may have been in the shadow of the chair sitting here on the conference table as well. So this is a good indication that for this type of fixture, you should be careful to get a thorough disinfection cycle that you may need to position the fixture in more than one location and run more than one disinfection cycle to actually achieve the best results for disinfecting an area.